Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. It's good to see you. If this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight raise or shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Into night shave, I am using my The Haddon brand. And this is by W.R. Humphrey and Company. Just a beautiful full hollow, maybe a bellied hollow. All right. Out of 1890 to 1919. Beautiful Sheffield England steel. Wonderful razor. And I will be revisiting Strike Gold Shaves. And this is Nixon. This is Limoncella, and I really like this one. This has got a fantastic scent. It really does. So, of course, I've got a little bit in this bowl blooming like normal. Let's go ahead and put that on as a pre-shave. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice scent. Yeah, that is fantastic. It really has a nice scent strength to it. Quite good. Okay. And I'm going to take a little bit more of that water out of that brush this time. And, of course, we're using this Omega 10,098. Big old beautiful brush. Let's get it loaded up. Yeah. All right. So hopefully you had a good Thanksgiving if you live here in the States or you just celebrate Thanksgiving when the States celebrate. Yeah. Hopefully you were able to spend some time with family and friends on that day. And maybe you can get a long weekend, right? Now this is Sunday, so that would be probably the last day of the weekend. But that's okay. It's all good. You know, hopefully you had good food, some downtime, and got to relax and enjoy. Be with family and friends. That's always so good. It really is. You can't beat that, I'm telling you. And the food, wow. Incredible, right? <laughs> All right, and hopefully you're well, you're enjoying your health, the world's been treating you good too, hopefully. And you're in high spirits. Yeah. Now, here we go. I'm just loading up that brush. Yes, I am. Gonna make sure. And this has got to be, got to be enough. So we're going to stop right there. And hopefully you're having good shaves. Are you having good shaves? Let me know. Put it down in the comments, right? That would be brilliant. All right, now we've got that around the bowl. Let's put that on. There we go. All right, and I do these Shave of the Day videos every Wednesday and Sunday. So stop on by, check it out. Look at this. Mm-hmm. Nice. Okay. There we go. Yeah, I'm liking the consistency on this. Nice and pasty. That's the way I like it. That's good. Oh yeah. Now, put some water on that. Look at that. <laughs> wow. I think we can even put a little bit more water on that. Mm 
really enjoy the boar hair brushes. For me, I do face lather all the time and uh, I enjoy the boar. It uh, really has a good face feel for me. Really work that lather into those whiskers. which is always good. Yeah, now yeah, there we go. All right, this is pass one, and that is mainly gonna be with the grain. So let's do this. Oh yeah, nice. And look at the cushion on that. Brilliant. Really quite good. shave so far. Really good. Here's my spots.
Nice. Oh yeah. Get that blade cleaned off. There you go, pass one complete. Yep, looking good. Okay, now let's go ahead, get that rinsed off, see how we did, right? Oh yeah, nice. Look at that, just cut right through that. That's so good. Okay. Now, let's get our lather on. Also, keep in mind that on the first and third Friday of every month, I do Straight Razor Edge Friday specials. And I answer your questions, comments, and make videos, actually, uh, from your suggestions that you uh, give me down in the comments. So feel free to put your question, comment, suggestions for a Straight Razor Edge Friday special down in the comments and we'll get to it. Yeah. I'll go ahead and do a video, give you a shout out. This brush does do it. <laughs> Gotta get that nose no matter what I do. There we go. Got it. Nice. I hope you are having some fantastic lathers as well. I know I've been doing really good with this Strike Gold Shave Mixer. It is excellent. So now basically this is going to be across the grain on my neck here, against the grain on my cheek, Gets the grain here and on my chin. Let's do this. Look at the peaks on that. Is that amazing or what? So nice. Here we go. Very good. Now 
Now when you're shaving, really all you need is just the weight of the blade. No pressure, okay? Weight of the blade only. Let that sharp razor take those hairs off. There's no pushing. There's no like really getting down in there. Don't do it, okay? I just want you to use the weight of the blade and let it glide over your face and cut those hairs. That's all you need, the weight of the blade. Weight of the blade and some good stretching. You want that skin nice and taut. There we go. Nice. There's those. Nice. All right, pass two complete. There you go. And this soap does have good slickness. It, it works quite well. Yep. Let's get that rinsed off. Oh, yeah. Wow, those cheeks are good. Yeah, they are. It's amazing how good of a shave you can get just by doing the same thing day in, day out, over and over, okay? It really works well and you get muscle memory and you can go to town and every time you do it you get better and you find a little better way a little better way to hold it a little better angle so good so just be encouraged you know it takes a little while to get going but it's totally worth it
Yeah, just keep going day after day, time after time. And each time you get more confident, you get more comfortable, and you'll get a better shave. All right, there we go. Now, this is the half pass, which is going to be against the grain on my jawline and my neck. And as a matter of fact, click right up here on that card to see the half pass revealed. All right. You'll be able to see everything in much more detail and I'll explain it even further. There we go. Yeah, it looks like maybe I, I hit one right there. No, nothing big though. No big deal. Another shave in the books. There you go. Let's see how we did. It felt good. It really did. And just fantastic soap. Good residual slickness. Oh yeah, nice. Nice. There we go. All right. Alum everywhere. There we go. Now I'm going to dry that off. Just like that. And for an aftershave. There's Lemon Witch Hazel. Lemonade for the face. Yes. Yes it is. And good for you. Mmm. Nice, wonderful lemon scent. There we go. Put that everywhere, of course. All right. And for our cologne thing tonight, we're going to step up the game. 
Florida water. Yeah, that's it. So we're gonna do a little of that. Yep. Nice. There we go. And to top off the shave, Nivea Post Shave Bomb. Yes. Gotta take care of that skin. It is good stuff. It really does take care of the skin quite well. There we go. Nice. All right. Hey, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate you stopping by. You can click right up here to see why you can't hone a straight razor. Okay? Very interesting. And, listen, I really appreciate all you do for me. You click right over here to see my latest video. Click down here on video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.